during a time and chain replacement, we've all been there. You open up the time and chain kit and notice new sprockets in the kit. You may think that you could save a lot of time and money by not replacing the sprockets, but you're opening yourself up to potential failure or reducing the longevity of the repair. If you think you can get away with not replacing the sprockets, remember chains and sprockets are both engineered together mechanically and metallurgically. When a time and chain stretches and fatigues, the relationship between the pins and links changes. These small dimensional fitment changes result in a summation of stretch and impact how the chains engage with the sprockets. This can cause adverse tooth wear, which will not line up to the replacement chain lacing or roller patterns. By the time a customer comes to your shop with a P0016 or P0017 code for camshaft to crankshaft correlation, chances are the wear has already occurred to the sprockets due to the stretch timing chains. In addition, misfires can impact the condition of the chain and sprockets by inducing damaging harmonics. If the misfire is caused by a pre-ignition event, the stresses on the sprockets and chains can be extreme. The cause of the misfire needs to be diagnosed either before or after the timing system is repaired. If the engine has suffered a catastrophic failure that has caused the engine to stop suddenly, damage has occurred. Therefore, the full system should be replaced. In the event that a well-maintained clean engine needs timing system repair, the reuse of sprockets can be considered. But keep in mind, the fatigue life of the system depends on the pairing of the fatigue life of each individual component. Don't let the fatigue life of the sprockets limit the repair longevity of the system as a whole. So, Cloys recommends that all components of the timing system be replaced at the same time. This includes the sprockets that are included with most time and chain kits and VVT system components when necessary. For more information on your technical questions, visit our tech center at cloys.com. I'm Cody Smith, tech support manager for Cloys. Thanks for watching.